Hello and welcome to our channel. Today, we're going to talk about one of the most notorious drug lords of our time, Osiel Cardenas Gillian. The state of Tamaulipas in northeastern Mexico has long been a hub for drug trafficking, with cartels battling for control of its lucrative smuggling routes. And in the late 1990s and early 2000s, one man emerged as the most powerful drug lord in the region, Osiel Cardenas Gillian. Born in Matamoros, Tamaulipas in 1967, Cardenas began his criminal career as a small-time drug dealer. But he quickly rose through the ranks of the Gulf Cartel, one of Mexico's largest drug trafficking organizations. The Gulf Cartel was known for smuggling large quantities of cocaine and marijuana across the U.S.-Mexico border, using Tamaulipas as a staging ground. And under Cardenas' leadership, the cartel became more powerful than ever before. But with power came violence. Cardenas and his associates were responsible for a wave of kidnappings, murders, and other violent crimes that terrorized the people of Tamaulipas. We couldn't leave our houses. We were afraid to go out. We couldn't send our children to school. It was a very difficult time. Cardenas was also known for his extreme brutality towards rivals and traitors within his own organization. He famously ordered the assassination of his own brother for betraying the cartel. Osiel Cardenas was a ruthless leader who would stop at nothing to maintain his power and control. He had a reputation for being one of the most violent and dangerous drug lords in Mexico. But despite his iron grip on the Gulf Cartel, Cardenas' reign came to an end in 2003. He was captured by Mexican special forces in a dramatic raid on his hideout in Matamoros. Cardenas was extradited to the United States, where he was convicted on multiple charges related to drug trafficking, money laundering, and racketeering. He was sentenced to 25 years in prison. Today, Cardenas is still serving his sentence in a maximum security prison in the United States. His capture dealt a major blow to the Gulf Cartel, but the organization continues to operate and remains one of Mexico's most powerful criminal enterprises. Osiel Cardenas Gillian may be behind bars, but his legacy of violence and terror still haunts the people of Tamaulipas. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos on true crime and other fascinating topics. See you next time.